So as we're finishing up topic five of classifying, we are going to end with our reteaching lesson. So for number one, it's asking you to find all the animals that walk on two legs. So if the animal walks on two legs, you will circle it. And I see right over here, I see an animal that walks on two legs. If the animal does not walk on two legs, you'll put a big X on it because it does not walk on two legs. And I see that this dog does not walk on two legs. He walks on four legs, so I will put an X on him. And you'll find all of those. For number two, let's look at our T-chart over here. It's asking how many toys are on the rug and how many toys are not on the rug. So you'll count and see how many toys are on the rug and draw tally marks in the chart. Then you'll write the number of tally marks or toys on the rug and not on the rug. For set C, let's look at our T chart. I see that it is asking me how many balls are white and how many balls are not white because it has an X on it. So you'll count how many are white, write the number, how many are not white, and write the number. But then you have to draw a circle around the group that is greater. And remember, greater means more. So whichever number is bigger, you will circle it. For set D number four, this is a student's work. And he is saying that the group of airplanes four is greater than the group of not airplanes, six. So is four greater than six? Yes or no? Is his work right or wrong? If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out. That is topic five. We will be moving on to topic 10 after this. Thank you.